thought here on Capitol Hill, those of us who have followed this story for quite some time, that this was a done deal. And what are the components of this bill? Were there twofold? One is a continuation of the 9-11 Victim Compensation Fund. The other is a permanent reauthorization of health care for all those 9-11 first responders and workers who got sick working on the pile there at Ground Zero. Remember, the government said the air was safe to breathe. It turned out it wasn't. And one of those folks who got sick was firefighter Ray Fire joins me now. Ray, you have terminal cancer. What brings you out here with terminal cancer to sit out in front of Mitch McConnell's office? You know, uh, I'm one guy of, out of 72,000. You know, I have the terminal cancer, you know, um, and Senator McConnell's got my life in his hands right now, um, as well as a lot of us first responders. You know, he, he, he just doesn't get it that we were the Marines. We were there for him and for the United States. And, and uh, he's not coming forth. He's not helping out. He's not, you know, I, I don't know what he wants out of this deal. It's a good deal. We have the majority of, um, uh, we have our votes that we need. We have, um, um, you know, uh, support from uh, both sides of the aisle, which was very important. And uh, he's just holding it up for some reason. We don't understand why. You're, you're quite sick. You're here in a wheelchair. Many of your friends are in the same predicament. Did you ever think you'd have to come to Washington, D.C. and ask your leaders, those who were so ready to throw up the flag and honor your service 14 years ago for these types of benefits? You know, um, after the 11th, you know, you had so many politicians. All they wanted to do was put their hands on your back and take pictures. Well, where are you now? What about what happened to never forget? And it seems like a lot of these politicians forgot, you know, uh, we're there for you when you want to get elected, but now we need your help. And, uh, I, you know, it's just, it's just a, a mind-boggling how this works. I've talked to you a few times. You have an intense sense of optimism. You think you're going to be okay at the end of the day here, with at least getting these funds? I, I'm, I'm always optimistic. I'm an optimistic person. I, 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 I'm just a little disheartened coming down here thinking that we're going to sign the bill and then all of a sudden being sandbagged you know by 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 this whole process here and uh hopefully it'll get done uh, while we're down here again I, I i'd hate to come down here again and drag other people that are sick um but if that needs to be done that's what we'll do Ray